Hi guys, so there's a huge difference between Keir Starmer and Boris Johnson. The leader of the Labour Party has his faults, but as a human being he comes across as someone who is professional and not an attention seeker. Boris Johnson, on the other hand, is a compulsive liar and narcissist, and this was perfectly demonstrated when both men were asked about comments Johnson made in the House of Commons. If you remember, Starmer received harassment and abuse outside Parliament following an accusation Johnson made in Parliament. Look at how both men dealt with what happened to Starmer. It's been reported that the police have launched an investigation into online threats made against you. Have you received death threats since the Prime Minister's false claim about Savile? The Prime Minister knew what he was doing when he uh, introduced that slur uh, the other day. Uh, but this is not about me. You know, there are threats to too many politicians, particularly women, actually. We've all got a duty to bring that level down and to return to the politics where we have strong debate, um, strong arguments, but it's rational, it's honest and it's done with integrity. Do you believe the Prime Minister is directly responsible for those threats because of his remarks about Savile? Well, the Prime Minister knew exactly what he was doing and words have consequences. But I do not want to turn this into an issue about myself because very many politicians um, receive abuse um, and threats. Women much more than men in terms of politics. We all, on a cross-party basis, have a duty to de-escalate these issues uh, and, and to conduct our politics properly in a rational and proper way. That's what a leader should say. That's exactly what a leader sounds like. Starmer is not putting himself into the centre of the focus here. He's taking himself out. He says, it shouldn't be about me. And he was responding to a question. He wasn't starting the discussion himself. He wasn't injecting himself into the situation. Now compare that with Johnson answering a question about the same subject. The opposition leader, Keir Starmer, has confirmed that he's received death threats following what you said in the House of Commons about Jimmy Savile. Mm. Do you feel responsible for that? And would you like to take the opportunity to apologise? I've said a, a, a more than enough about that issue. It's, it's all a joke to Johnson. I've said enough about that issue. He wasn't going to apologise. Like, a politician, the leader of the opposition, is receiving death threats. And Boris Johnson couldn't be bothered to say, I'm sorry, even sorry that he's receiving death threats, which is not a real apology, but he couldn't even go that far. Just doesn't give a crap. He understands that the fire that he has lit is starting to get out of control. And instead of actually trying to take responsibility, apologize and try and fix it. No, no, he's happy with that. He's delighted that that's what's happening at the moment. That Starmer is being accused once again that there are people uh, abusing him in the street, potentially harassing and potentially harming him. But Johnson doesn't care because it's not happening to him. It's happening to someone else. This is the type of person who allegedly burned a 50 pound note in front of a homeless person in order to get into a club. This is not somebody who cares about others. He only cares about himself. And I think this clip demonstrated that he sees the, the consequences of his actions, but he doesn't care about the consequences of his actions. Let me know in the comment section, guys, what you think about all of this. As always, your comments are greatly appreciated. Thanks a lot.